Hi everybody, in this quick video I wanted to share the technique that I use to make YouTube Shorts really quickly. And this is best for very simple one and done YouTube Shorts where you record the gameplay and the thing that you want to talk about uh, all at the same time. Um, the problem with, with creating shorts is really the aspect ratio when it comes to them, isn't it? So, you know, you'll go into, for example, uh, Daisy, um, and you'll record your video in one go. So, they, hi, I want to talk to you today about how to, you know, get rid of wolves when they when they chase you. You know, how do you get rid of that? And you obviously make it less than 60 seconds. You capture that gameplay however you want. So, maybe it's with GeForce Experience, maybe it's with OBS, whatever thing you want. Um, and then you come out of that... Um, and then you have to import it into your editing software, whatever that might be. This is an old version of Vegas. And then you've got to change the aspect ratio. You've got to zoom in, you've got to add titles, all that sort of stuff, which is the bit that can take a little bit of time, even if you have templates set up for, for shorts. So this is the way that I suggest you do it. Go into Daisy, or whichever program it is, capture your one and done, so you're recording the audio and the video at the same time with GeForce Experience or OBS or whatever. And then the trick, if it, is, if it is a trick, is to have Google Drive installed on your computer and on your phone. And of course, on your phone, you've got to have the YouTube app. And so what you do is that you transfer the gameplay footage from your laptop to Google Drive, sorry, from your PC to Google Drive. So you drag it into uh, the web browser for Google Drive. That uploads it to the cloud. And then on your phone, you go into Google Drive and you download it to your phone and this enables you to open it up in the YouTube app so I'll put a link in the description below this video to my guide on how to make shorts in the YouTube app it's very simple you just open up the YouTube app you hit the plus button at the bottom you'll see once your clips downloaded you'll see it there you tap on it you can move the video around a bit to kind of centralize it but you can't really crop and zoom so that is a bit limited but um, you say it's going to be a 60 second video and then you can add your title um, and it's really fast, then you can upload it to, to YouTube. And it really cuts out all of this messing around with trying to um, get rid of, uh, to, to change aspect ratios and zooms. And it stops you kind of really getting sucked into spending too much time making shorts. Now you might well say, well Rob, actually, when I make my shorts, <laughs> I want to make them production masterpieces. And if you want to do that and you want to import the gameplay, you know, and, and record a voiceover and all that sort of stuff, great, you know, go for it. But I know my <laughs> you'll know if you if you know my channel, the way that I approach video production <laughs> is I don't really have that much production value. You know, I work full time, I've got loads of equipments at work and at home, and I just don't have that much time to do this sort of stuff. So anything I do has to be done really, really quickly. And I try and distill the information that I'm trying to give people in the simplest form as possible and when it comes to video production making videos for me the one and done method is the best way for me so it's hitting record on the screen capture software and doing what I've got to do and talking about what I've got to do at the same time and what this enables me to do though is be quite nimble in the sheer number of YouTube shorts I can create so I can get ahead of the game and get loads in the bag ready for you know, releasing one a day or whatever it might be, whatever my schedule might be. Um, also, it means I can look at lots of different um, subjects as well. And I was listening to Tarduck's podcast the other day when he was interviewing a uh, content creator from the um, Escape from uh, Tarkov um, community. And I can't remember who it was, and I'm really sorry for this, but they said something, they quoted something really important, and that is... YouTube is really good at showing people good videos and so you shouldn't worry about making what might be a bad video you know so you make a video that's not going to get shown to many people or isn't that good because not many people are going to see it anyway because if it's a bad video in and of itself YouTube just won't show it to people <laughs> it just doesn't whereas if you happen to make some good videos it will you know they could well you know get discovered and and you'll uh, get lots of views and that will drive primarily you know views and hopefully um, drive more subscribers to your channel and then you know drive up revenue as well so there we go because one of my big barriers to youtube shorts was the time that it would take to edit them and do all that sort of stuff compared to a normal video you know which i know you know can work for me so hopefully you found this technique useful and as i say so to kind of go to kind of uh, go through what it is it's to capture the, the gameplay and the audio at the same time using OBS or GeForce Experience or something like that you install Google Drive on your 
uh, computer and on your phone. You upload the footage to Google Drive from your computer. On your phone, you download it. You open that up in the YouTube app and you create the short on your phone. You know, add the titles and then you upload it to YouTube. There we go. Hopefully you found this video useful. If you have it, like, if you want to see more, press subscribe. And I will, of course, see you again soon.